Hello and welcome. You join me from the bonny banks of Loch Lomond. We're on the, the beautiful island of Inchconachan. Uh, we decided to come up here today as the boat's not been run over the winter, so we thought we'd give it a wee day out. And it gives me a wee chance to, to catch up on photographing some of the, the lovely Scots pine uh, and, and other woodland on, on the island. It is said the island is home to many wallabies that were released years ago uh, by a, a woman that used to live on the island. I, I have seen them a couple of years ago, I've not seen them for a long time, so you know, never know. Uh, we might get a wee glimpse of one of these elusive wallabies today. Uh, there's also a lovely abandoned building with a, a hand-painted mural, uh, which hopefully we can, we can get a wee look at uh, in between taking some shots and exploring the island. It's quite quiet today. Uh, it's a Saturday right enough, so it will, it will heat up uh, as the day goes on with other boats and passers-by. As the island can only be accessed by boat or kayak or canoe, uh, or the odd jet ski that goes buzzing by. Uh, it's not ideal for photography today, it's kind of blue skies and uh, it's quite harsh. But you know, we'll, we'll head, in, head inland and, and see, what we, see what we get and we'll take you along with me. If you stick around, we'll see what we get. This is a little hut I was talking about earlier on, so let's go ahead and get inside. messing about in that house which is it's a shame uh, obviously it's, it's it's long in ruin but uh, as, as usual there is a, a small minority that decide to wreck things and graffiti things and break things and uh, don't be that guy you know that muriel in there must have taken some day hours day, probably days or months even of work you know it, it is a masterpiece but uh, it's been graffitied I hope it didn't show up on the video uh, as it's quite rude so <laughs> Uh, but if it did, I do apologise. Uh, but anyway, we have found this little composition. Uh, I, th I believe it's a rhododendron tree that's, that's not quite come out yet and it's just absolutely covered in moss uh, with the sun, sun kind of back, lighting it. Uh, as you can see, I've got my camera set up nice and low. Uh, I'm going to have to bracket. Uh, there's no way I could control those kind of highlights uh, underneath. Bracket, one under and one over should, should be more than enough. Uh, I've taken another composition, I was pretty close up, uh, so I have photo stacked, I, I'm not sure I particularly like that one as much as the, the light, the backlit one, the backlit is, is very nice, there's little spider webs and, and all sorts in here, so it is quite nice. Setting wise, f8, quarter of a second, uh, ISO 64, base ISO for the D850, uh, so yeah, we'll, we'll muck about here for a wee bit and see what else I get. Hopefully that'll turn out a nice little image. It certainly pushed my boundaries for, for composition wise. Most of you will know I, I prefer big vistas. And as of late, if you follow my Instagram, you'll see my, late, my latest images that I'm trying to find more compositions in the chaotic scenes that I would usually just walk on by, especially woodland, you know, waterfalls, things like that. So we'll head on back off wander about the island see what else we can find not really found too much uh, until till now so yeah i've still got all day so we'll see what we find <laughs>
going to wrap it up there for my very first vlog from Loch Lomond. If you like my content or, or you want to see what I'm up to in the future on this channel, please be sure to subscribe. Uh, I'd also appreciate a like and a comment. Until next time, bye for now. Thank you.